Today we're going to show you how to repair an engine computer or an ECM or a PCM. There's many different terminologies, but basically the computer that runs your motor and your transmission. On this Durango here, first thing we're going to do is we're going to pop the hood, locate the engine computer, which in this year make a model is located on the inner fender well on the passenger side. It's a three plug unit, call it a JTEC. First thing you're going to do is remove the three bolts that are holding the ECM to the bracket which is connected to the frame or body of the vehicle. So we're going to end up removing the screws, plugs are going to come out, we're going to remove the engine computer. Now there's many different scenarios in which this computer goes bad. Very common is P700 codes, tranny codes. Uh, P0601 code, P0505 code, uh, very, very common warm and die, you're just driving down the road, just dies on you. Basically, once the vehicle reaches a certain temperature, it dies, uh, or no communications. Um, basically, you'll get a no bus message on your uh, odometer, on your speed, speedo in the cluster in the car. So let's go ahead and... Uh, check this unit out this one has already been remanufactured by Mopar once before uh, but we're gonna go ahead and fix this right the first time so we'll never have this problem again all right first thing we're gonna do to get this computer fixed correctly the first time is we are going to go to your computer laptop PC of your preference you're going to go to the top search bar in the URL and you're going to type in Auto Computer Specialist. Alright, that's going to be the website there. First thing we're going to do is we're going to scroll down here a little bit. On the left hand side you see repair services, a little toolbox and it says fix your computer. We're going to click that. Very important. On the second line for repair service, click this link to download the R&R form. Once again, this is very important before sending your computer to us to get repaired. Uh, this is basically going to have all the information that we need uh, so we do not have to call you. Uh, we start repairs on it right away and uh, we call you the same day, let you know your baby's done and we get it on out to you as quick as possible. So what you're going to do is you're going to go on the right hand side here, and towards the middle, it's going to pop up, you're going to hit print. So once that repair and rebuild form is filled out completely, okay, what you're going to do is, you're going to get your computer with that repair form. And you're going to send them both together to us. You're going to wrap up the computer with the repair form. Make sure you wrap the computer very well so that the plugs don't break or it doesn't get damaged in shipping. Okay? Then what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and put it in a box. Tape it up. Use a good tape so nothing falls out of the box. Then you're going to go ahead and go to the UPS store or to your local post office. Uh, local post office is probably your cheapest way to go uh, unless you have accounts or anything like that uh, but you're going to get that over to us right away once we receive that unit we are going to call you let you know that it is here we have all the information because of this repair form which is very important uh, no delay of time for the repair because of this form uh, we'll call you up a couple hours later let you know that your baby's all done and uh, we can collect payment on the phone. There's no need to send any checks or money orders or anything like that because if your unit tests good, um, you know, we're not going to charge you for the repair service. So uh, let me give you our telephone number here, 954-513-8359, Eastern Standard Time. Or you could reach us at autocomputerspecialist.com. Or you could just go to our Gmail account, which is autocomputerspecialist at gmail.com. Okay, we're located here in Plantation, Florida, 221 South State Road 7, zip code is 33317. Everybody have a good day, and thank you for checking out our video.